according to the golden mean a in ratio to the intercanine width should be so if you understand a a is this particular area that is the width of the central incisor the left central incisor so uh, there is something called w that is the width of the intercanine width actually so that is the width from the distal aspect of the right canine to the distal aspect of the canine on the contralateral side that means on the left side right so this complete area is w and this is a so according to the golden mean or we can call it as golden percentage which was given by snow okay so according to the golden percentage what should be the width or the proportion or the ratio with the internal can uh, intercanine width of the width of your central incisor right so uh, one rule is that according to snow it was recommended that 60% lateral to incisor ratio should be there lateral to incisor width ratio should be there that means this particular thing is called as the golden percentage what does that mean that means that whatever the width of the central incisor for example we have x then the later incisors width should be 60% of the x and the width of your canine here should be 60% of this particular value so if 60% of x is going to be z so it will be 60% of z so that is one um, rule that is called as the golden percentage and it is very useful in smile design okay so this golden proportion is used in smile design to give the proper width to the various anterior teeth in the aesthetic jaw right now if we try to find out the ratio of this particular width that is your a uh in the show with the intercanine width right so here the intercanine width is given as w that is the width from the distal aspect of the canine on both the side right and here you will be getting that the central incisor when compared to the total intercanine width it should be 20% 25% of the total intercanine width according to the golden proportion each maxillary later incisor should be 15% of the width and each canine should be 10% of the intercanine width when viewed from the anterior view remember it has to be viewed from the anterior or basically it should be viewed from the front right so basically if you just try to compare this particular distance with the intercanine width it would be 25% of your w that means 0.25w here this particular distance is going to be uh, 0.15w and this particular area is going to be 0.10w so basically this is the 25% of the intercanine width so answer to this question is going to be we have been asked about a this particular distance so actual ratio according to the golden percentage golden proportion or golden mean is going to be first that is 25%